In additive number theory, the Fermat polygonal number theorem states that every positive integer is a sum of at most n n gonal numbers. That is, every positive integer can be written as the sum of three or fewer triangular numbers, and as the sum of four or fewer square numbers, and as the sum of five or fewer pentagonal numbers, and so on. Examples <laughs> 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 Three such representations of the number 17, for example, are shown below. 17 equals 10 plus 6 plus 1 triangular numbers. 17 equals 16 plus 1 square numbers. 17 equals 12 plus 5 pentagonal numbers. Equals Topic History Topic <laughs> The theorem is named after Pierre de Fermat, who stated it, in sixteen thirty eight, without proof, promising to write it in a separate work that never appeared. Joseph Louis Lagrange proved the square case in 1770, which states that every positive number can be represented as a sum of four squares, for example, seven. Four plus one plus one plus one. Gauss proved the triangular case in 1796, commemorating the occasion by writing in his diary the line "Eureka num equals delta plus delta plus delta," and published a proof in his book Disquisitions Arithmetici. For this reason, Gauss' result is sometimes known as the Eureka theorem. The full polygonal number theorem was not resolved until it was finally proven by Cauchy in 1813. The proof of Nathanson 1987 is based on the following lemma due to Cauchy, for odd positive integers are and b such that b2 are. S2 plus T2 plus U2 plus V2 and B. S plus T plus U plus V. Topic. See also. Pollux conjectures. Waring's problem equals equals notes <laughs>